which of these shapes is a regular polygon? Welcome to Mr. Sanchez and his man. Today we're going to be talking about the TIC 5.5a classified two dimensional features. Specifically, we're going to be talking about polygons and non polygons. This is the lesson two out of five. So let's get started. This is all about concept. So let's first review the concept of a two dimensional figure. This is a figure with two basic units of measure, usually length and width, only those two. So now from this rectangle, this cube and this triangle, which one of those are two dimensional figures? Yes, the rectangle and the triangle because the one in the middle, it has a third dimension that is height. So we're not working with that one anymore. Now let's go with the next concept. The next concept we're talking about are polygons. So a polygon is a closed figure with at least three sides and all sides are straight, no curves. So let's see the shape that we have. So the first shape, is that a closed figure? Yes, it is. Does it have at least three sides? No, it's a circle. So that one cannot be a polygon. The second shape, is that a closed figure? No, because it has two sides. So that one cannot be a polygon. The third shape, is that a closed figure? Yes. With at least three sides? Yes, it has four. And then all sides are straight? Yes, all sides are straight. Now let's go with the last one. Is that a closed figure? Yes. With at least three sides? Mm, as you can see, it has four sides. However, the corners are not there. It has curves. So that means that the only one that can be a polygon out of these four is the trapezoid. So let's continue with the next one. So now let's talk about the regular polygon. It's a polygon with all sides and angles that are congruent. So the first shape that we have on the left side is our triangle with two sides congruent, but one is not. So that one cannot be a regular polygon. The second shape that we have is a triangle with all its sides the same. So yes, that one can be a regular polygon. The third shape that we have is a quadrilateral. However, the sides are, are not congruent, so that one cannot be a regular polygon. And the last one, it is a quadrilateral. However, all the sides are congruent. So that means that from these four shapes, these two are not regular polygons, but the triangle and the square, they are. Now, let's show time. Which of these shapes is a regular polygon? So as you can tell, we were having this one at the beginning, but I think that right now we can. If you see the triangle, all its sides are congruent. The cube, it has a third dimension, so it cannot be, it cannot be in this case a two-dimensional figure. The rectangle, yes, it's a polygon, however, not all its sides are congruent. The circle, it's a circle, like it doesn't have sides or something like that, so we cannot say that that one is a polygon and the last one it has curves. So that means that the only one that can be a regular polygon here is a triangle. So now you know what polygons are and their attributes. If we want to continue working with this and want to use this diagram to be working about two dimensional figures. Today we learn about polygons that are close figure with at least three sides and all sides are straight. And if they are not polygon, we're gonna call them non-polygons. Thank you very much, guys. This was Mr. Sanchez and his math. Today we were classifying two-dimensional figure, specifically working about polygons and non-polygons. This was the lesson two out of five. Remember, before you leave, take some notes. Have a good one.